Well, hello there, ladies and gentle man. It is Scythe here, welcoming you to this wonderful Monday that we are in. And I thought I'd go ahead and show you a little Modern Warfare 3 since I did the uh, Modern Warfare 3 live stream on Saturday. I was really, you know, excited to play it on Saturday. I had a lot of fun with a lot of fans, and I thought I'd go ahead and just keep playing it through the weekend. I, had, I, I really miss how fun this game really, really is. And it's still fun. It, has, it hasn't been hacked that I can see. I mean, nobody's really uh, floating around in space or throwing hot dogs at my face or anything to make me feel disgrace or I don't think I can rhyme anything else. But the game seems pretty untouched. Uh, everyone's still having fun with it. It's not, you know, a game where you feel like you're walking into a bunch of people who just camp all day now. Everybody seems to be running around more. Like in this game, you know, I'm kind of, you know, I'm just playing the objective and running around trying to knock down as many teammates as possible. I'm not really worried about deaths because, you know, Modern Warfare 3 is kind of over as far as competitive gaming is going. So the KDR doesn't really bother me. You know, the kill streaks don't really bother me. I'm just kind of like running around and just kind of just slaughtering people and having fun. And, you know, I do pretty good in this game. But the main reason why I'm doing this video today is because I'm excited about one of the newest sponsors that uh, added to my... Uh, little gaming network of bunnies and ostriches. Um, besides Machinima and Elgato, I now have the ControllerShop.com, which now sponsors me, and they are one of the leading elite custom controller companies in the world right now. Um, if you haven't seen them yet, um, check out Facebook slash Controller Shop. They have over 300,000 fans. And on the web, you can check them out at www.thecontrollershop.com. And just to give you an idea of what I'm talking about, I'm not talking about just, you know, somebody puts a sticker on your controller or they may paint it a nice solid color or something like that. I'm talking about actual custom paint job and modded controllers now by modded i mean like you know they you help you cheat i mean i'm pretty i'm sure they have an area on there if you guys want some uh, rapid fire or something like that whatever get your floats your boat personally i i like playing the game but you know i'm if you really want to get stuff like that that's fine but they do have you know the airbrushed the bullet back casing buttons i mean the custom here i'm just going to give you an idea right here right here it's a purple just deep with skulls uh airbrushed in there i mean that's just real just that's a sick controller and i personally it, i just that's way better than anything you're going to see in a store i'll tell you that right now and the paint job right now that i really like which uh Seems to be one of their favorites as well. And I'm going to show you uh, the Xbox version. It's the Blood Splatter uh, paint job, which, I, I mean, that's just, I think it's awesome. I mean, look at the bullet casing buttons. I mean, it just looks phenomenal. And just in case for people who are asking, yes, they make it for PS3 too. Bam! There it is. PS3 controller, Blood Splatter, bullet casing buttons. Even a nice little cool styrofoam case. It looks like you're carrying some sort of a nuclear explosive or something probably not something you want to walk through an airport with but still it's a fantastic looking controller so I mean if you're gonna go I mean I go through a million controllers I mean I go through a bunch of them because the uh, thumbsticks wear off or the buttons aren't really working I mean these guys put like r nice custom buttons on that don't wear off they do custom paint jobs so that you know nobody can steal your controller and say it's theirs or you know it's, it's something that you know not everybody has you don't have to go to GameStop and buy something where you think you're buying a, a nice $120 custom controller and it turns out like everyone in your neighborhood has one and it's wired and it's really not that fun to play with. I mean, you want to get something that you really, really can set you apart as a gamer. And, you know, if you're as hardcore as a gamer as I am, and there's a lot of people that are even more hardcore gaming than I am, then you really want to take pride you know, and what you have, and what better way to do that than to, you know, have a controller that you can actually customize yourself, and they can professionally do it, and, I mean, to be honest with you, really hardcore gamers, they don't buy a whole lot of games, you know, like, I'm a Call of Duty gamer, so I play all the Call of Duty, so I buy those, but I really don't buy that many other games, um, you know, with the Xbox and the PlayStation coming out with new systems, right now, there's really nothing to, uh, interesting to do to add, so instead of, you know, buying games right now, you know, just do something to, kind of make my Xbox or my 
PlayStation 3 just kind of look real custom and, you know, classy and, you know, GQ-ish, if you will. And getting a really nice controller like this is pretty much, you know, the best option that I can think of. And the good thing about it is, is that all you guys get to benefit from my sponsorship as well, not just me getting free swag, which, you know, I, it is fun, I'm, I'm not going to lie, but you guys are actually all, if you're a subscriber or a fan of mine, you have a coupon code you can use on the website, which takes 20% off. A fifth of the price, they're going to take off the uh, controller. All you got to do is put in Nation 20 so Nation 20 and you'll get 20% off. And I, I, th I think that's an amazing gesture on their part. They're making a custom controller for me right now, which I will be able to do an unboxing video for to give you guys an idea of what they do so that you guys can feel confident that, you know, uh, you're getting a good controller and getting something that, you know, will make you happy and make your friends pissed off. And this isn't the controller to rage quit to and throw against the wall. I mean, I'm pretty sure if you want to, you can do whatever you want, but probably not something that you want to, uh, you know, throw against the wall or whatever. My suggestion would be something that you'd probably keep this as like your vintage set. And this is for like any kind of gamer. Competitive gaming, you know, people that are diehard gamers, people that are like younger people, older people. It's just really nice to have and it even makes your game room or wherever you have your video games set up look really cool. So that's pretty exciting. And So if you guys could, if you can give a, this video a like, you know, just give me a thumbs up on it. I really appreciate it. Let me know if you do like the Modern Warfare 3 videos. If we should go back to Black Ops 2. If Modern Warfare 3 is kind of fun to do. Like, maybe, maybe Modern Warfare Mondays. You know, maybe you have a good Modern Warfare 3 video to play on Mondays. If that sounds like a good idea for you, you know, let me know in the comments. Um, and if you, get, if you haven't already, guys, make sure you subs click the subscription button. Because right now we're doing a giveaway, you know, we're giving away a $65 gift card to GameStop or a game of your choice for a subscriber. And that video is on my channel, so check that out. And if you do want to play with me on the live streams that I do, because I did a live stream over the weekend, had fun with a bunch of friends and fans. And, you know, all the people that were in the stream, if they were online, I was trying to get them all in the game. I'm sorry I can't get to everybody, but I try to get as many people as I could. But if you want to be in the live streams, just follow me on my Facebook fan page, which will be linked in the description of this video. And go ahead and go like the controllershop.com because they give out some different cool uh, discounts and stuff like that, and they show some really cool picks. So it's even even if you're not gonna buy something, or not gonna buy a controller, it's cool to have on Facebook cool little sick picks of controllers that are just really fun to look at. So just even if you're not gonna buy anything, I like having it on my Facebook just so I can see the awesome pictures. But I do get games from them. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoyed my time. I hope you guys had fun sitting down with me. I hope you enjoy the rest of your week. Have a great day. Take care. Peace out!